In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a minimum slash maximum quantity rule within WooCommerce. So the first thing you want to do is enable this minimum maximum quantity rules plugin. Once you've installed it, go ahead and toggle it to on. Okay, once it's activated, we should see this min max quantity rules menu. So on a global level, we can create a minimum slash maximum order quantity rule or order value rule on a global level. And we can choose who you want to target this rule to. So for example, we can target it to guest users. So everyone who isn't logged into your site, or we can target it to a specific user role. So in my case, I'm logged in as admin. You can target it to um, wholesalers, distributors, and so on. So for this example, I'm just going to select administrator. And the minimum quantity of item in an order is, so this is on a global level. So I'm guessing this is the minimum quantity I'm able to have in my basket is a free. So let's go ahead and save this option. I should note as well, if you've got multiple rules targeting the same user, then the first rule will basically um, be activated for that re user. For example, I've just created a new rule here. So for example, I could target this to admin. And this is a different rule. This is based on order value. So the minimum order value allowed is $70. In this case, because they're both targeting the admin, the first rule will apply first. So this one will apply first and the second one will be ignored for this admin user. So let's go ahead and let's add two. Well, let's refresh this page. Um, let's go accessories. Beanie with logo. Now let's try add a two. Okay, I've already I've already got a few products in my cart, so let's go ahead and remove them. Okay, and in here we can see this message here saying the minimum um, number of quantity required for me to check out is three. Currently I've got two. So if I up this to two, if to three, and then upgrade my cart, then I should be able to check out no problem. And it works just the same for the maximum um, quantity allowed per order. And the order value works in a similar way. So again, I'm targeting the admin. Uh, let's see, my cart total is fifty-four dollars. So let's say. The minimum um, order value required to check out is $60, meaning I have to spend more than $60 to be able to check out. So let's save this rule. Let's update our cart. And in here, you can see the message showing. And the maximum works just the same. So let's say the maximum um, order value is, let's say, $50. If you remember, my cart value is... 54 so I should get a message basically prompting me to remove um, an item from a basket so there we go maximum allowed is $50 please remove some item from a basket so this is on a global level so let's remove this rule okay and then let's just save or we could have discarded it just to be sure and then on the product level let's set a minimum slash maximum order quantity rule I'll also show you how to create um, order increments as well so as you'll notice we've got this new option here minimum slash maximum quantity rules and uh, similar to the global level um, the first rule applies when a user falls into multiple rules. So for example, 
um, we've got everyone and then we could add a new rule targeting um, admin in that case the everyone rule would trigger first okay so let's set this to everyone so in this case the minimum quantity will be let's say five okay let's let's do this for now so let's update okay so here we can see the minimum for this particular product quantity is a five and we can't go below five but we can go higher we can also set order increments sorry quantity increments so here in groups of let's see in groups of five and then let's just update this okay now our order quantity should increase um, in steps of five so as you can see here we can add a 10 to our cart and that's it for our minimum maximum order quantity rule if you've got any questions or feature requests don't hesitate to contact support and somebody will get back to you as, as soon as possible.